Wow. Okay, so the reason why I'm doing this one is it has a GCF, greatest common factor. Okay, so if you guys remember from the first video, I have a GCF there, and sometimes it applies and sometimes it doesn't. In this case, it does. Okay, 3, 9, 84. Okay, is 9 divisible by 3? Yeah. Okay, 84 though, some of you might be like, wait, let me divide, let me see. Okay, 84 divisible by 3. Yes, it is, it's 28. Right? Okay, so GCF, it's a good thing. When I was a student, I kind of liked the GCF because then it dummies down the problem to where it's a really easy factoring problem. And then that's a good thing. Okay, so each of these numbers is divisible by 3. So my GCF is 3. All 3 well, coefficient, coefficient constant, are divisible by 3. So go ahead and divide by 3, but don't lose the 3. Keep track of it. Remember, you'll do well in math the more organized you are. Right? 84 divided by 3 is 28. Negative 9 divided by 3 is negative 3. Yeah. Oh, no. No, you're just talking about it. And 3 divided by 3 is 1. Right? Okay, so now look, this is a super easy factoring problem. Your A value is 1. So now I can just go straight to magic x if you want. But now you're back to what two numbers multiply to 28 would give you negative 3 as a summation. Add and subtract. So what are the numbers? Well, you see 28. What two numbers give you 28? Right off the top of your head. The one. Huh? Yeah, 1 times 28, but what's the one that you guys usually go to first? 7 and 4. Huh? 7 and 4, 4 and 7. Right? There's some um, pairs of numbers that you automatically, like if I give you 50, it's kind of a 50 50 between you guys going 1, I'm uh, going 2 and 25, or 5 and 10. Like, some of you just go directly to a specific number. All right, so look, 28, most of you would go 4 and 7. Well, what's sub the subtraction of 4 and 7? 3. So you have the numbers there, you just have to get the signs correct. Okay, so look, here you have 28 is positive, 3 is negative. Um, so you have 4 and 7. Oh, wait, but it's not factorable, you guys. Wait, did I copy it right? Oh, you guys, 84 is negative on the assignment. Can we fix it? Yeah, okay. I was like, it's not factorable. I'll show you guys the assignment. Yeah, because I'm like, uh, we're not factoring this. This is not factorable. See, look, I'll show you. See that little negative? I thought it was a positive. It's a negative. Okay. Oh, hopefully that didn't kick you guys out. Okay, so this is a negative. Hold on, let it dry. Negative, negative, negative. Okay. 28 is negative, which means the only way you get a negative product is one number is positive, one number is negative, correct? Okay, because the 3 is negative, which number, which sign is going to be the bigger one? The negative, very good. Yeah. Okay, so you guys agreed, how do you get 28? 1 and 28, 2 and 14, 3 doesn't divide into it, 4 and 7. When subtracted, which one gives you 3? You guys already said, yeah, 4 and 7. So 4 is a positive, 7 is a negative. This is not factored. This just helps you get your values. And so how do you write it then? You cannot forget about this GCF3. Bring that down. You cannot leave it out. And so now it becomes x plus, oh, it's an 
n plus 4, n minus 7. Here, let's rewrite it. <coughs> and so that is factored form. By the way, if you ever guys go back to x, even though regardless of what the variable is, you don't get dot. It's actually really common. So this one ended up being a very easy problem if you were able to identify the GCF. Now, what happens if you don't get the GCF? You're going you're gonna to have to take what's 3 times negative 84. So 3 times negative 84 gives you negative 252. So say if you did not do that, your magic X would be negative 9. What two numbers multiply to negative 252 but sum to negative 9? You're going off the original. Now, it could be done, but the numbers are very high. Look for the GCF. It's a good thing if you look for the GCF if you can take it down. Yeah? I don't know how much of this you guys practiced last year. I know we get... We, we make you do the A times C, but I don't know how many like GCF ones they had you do. Usually it's not as many. Okay, so let me just stop this and I'll let it load and then it'll come back up. Okay, so just 